Captain Frederick Marriott, adventurer, author, sea captain. Who? No, seriously, who? Hello, internet. I am part of the team behind the upcoming short film about Captain Frederick Marriott. There doesn't seem to be an awful lot of public knowledge about who Frederick Marriott is. Captain Frederick Marriott. No. Captain Frederick Marriott. I have no idea. Captain Frederick Marriott. No. Um, no, I haven't. No. Have you heard of the Children of the New Forest? No. Children of the New Forest, what, the book? Yes. Yeah. Do you know anything about the guy that wrote it? No. Okay. Have you heard of Captain Frederick Marriott? No. I haven't. But what did he do, I hear you ask? Born in 1792, he crammed an awful lot into his 56 years. Ran for Parliament. He was a captain by the age of 24. He drew Napoleon on his deathbed. A year-long tour of America. He sailed under Lord Cochrane. He lived in Paris. He lived in London. He lived in America. He was friends with Charles Dickens. Fought in the Battle of the Basque Roads. He wrote The Children of the New Forest. Friends with the royal family. Invented a system of flags for communication that is still used by the Navy today. Wrote over 30 novels. Present at Nelson's funeral. He ran his own farm. Married at 19. He campaigned against impressment into the Navy. He had seven surviving kids. He fought in Canada against an uprising. Spent his final years in Norfolk with his daughters. With so many achievements under his belt, it's really surprising that the general public don't know more about him. We're gonna tell his life story intertwined with his most famous work, The Children of the New Forest. This means we're gonna be creating a period drama within a period drama. And so getting both periods accurate is gonna be the key to our success. Even the little things will really help us. So retweet us, donate to us if you can, share this video and spread the word. With your help, we really feel that we can make this something special. Thank you for watching.